the only thing is to become more and more alert. Just watch. You see greed arising in one way, watch it. Don't try to stop it, otherwise it will arise in another way. It may choose just the opposite so it can deceive you. You don't do anything to it, otherwise it will find another way. No need to fight with it, just watch it, let it be there, watch it. See it naked, throw and throw. Awareness functions like X-ray. It sees seeing things through and through. And in that very seeing, there is freedom. If you have seen the greed totally, in that very seeing, greed disappears. Not that you make it disappear, it disappears. In that vision, it is not found. In that light, that darkness is no more there. Suddenly you are free of greed. And when you are free of greed, you know you have never left the home. You have always been there. You had never left God. Adam has never been expelled from the Garden of Eden. He still lives there. Just he dreams that he has been expelled. This is the Zen interpretation of the biblical story. I must have given you a thousand interpretations about that. The story, the story is so beautiful. Zain says Adam is, is still living in the garden of Eden. The snake has not tricked him into sin. The snake has only tricked him into a dream. And God has not expelled him. How God can expel you and where he can expel? It is all his garden. Where you will be. Wherever you will be, it will be his garden, so he, where he can expel. And how God can expel? Expelling Adam, God will be expelling himself, a part of himself. He will fall into parts. No, it is not possible. Then what has happened? Adam has fallen asleep. Eating the fruit of the tree of knowledge, Adam has fallen asleep and is dreaming that God is very angry. It is his own dream, it is his own idea, it is his own guilt, it is his own mind that I have broken the rule, that I had promised and I have broken my promise. Now he is trembling and feeling guilty and in the sleep the guilt is creating a dream that God is very angry. He is projecting his guilt on God. His guilt is becoming God's anger in his mind. Naturally, God must be very angry and he is expelling him and he has expelled him. The gates are closed and Adam is thrown into the world. But it is just a dream. The moment Adam becomes awake, he will laugh. He will have a uproarious laugh. He will roll down on the ground. His belly will start bursting with the laughter. Because he will see the whole absurdity of it. He had never been out. Have you not dreamed dreams like this?